Marcus, I heard that, but that's true. No one in the band really snores. That's what Marcus is here. Yeah, that's why we got Marcus. I think. I don't. Oh, yeah, duh. Marcus, he's a terrible snorer. Marcus, the fifth member of the band. <laughs> the, the most menacing member of the band. Oh, Marcus. Thank you. Thank you for the lead. Because I was like, none of us snore. We don't, actually. We are, we're very, we're blessed in that. But um, but yes, Marcus, our security guy, is the worst. Uh, we used to have quite worse than Marcus, though, uh, in our crew. But but now, again, by forfeit, he's, he's taken the reins. He's doing all right with him. <laughs> There's no mutiny. People are happy with his with his abilities. I don't think that Marcus. And that's 100% the case. He has to sleep in a different section of the bus than me. It's like crazy bad. <laughs> I mean, it would have been Pete a couple years ago, but he's probably the best, the most professional in the band now. He's made a huge, huge change. Uh, Patrick's been the latest from uh, for Lobby Call lately, and I don't think it's like on purpose. I think he just, you know, sleeps as long as he, as he can, and then packing takes forever, way longer than you think always. So I'll, but but then again, he takes warming up most seriously. So it's a, I, it's tough. They all suck. Let's say that. Oh, I don't know. I think volleys between myself and Pete at times. I'd say you know, um, I was, I was, you know, only because I'd say Pete used to be the guy who's like late and all the and, and stuff. I'm just the guy that like. Because I'm the last guy to the bus, I'm the guy with the drinking problem. I'm gonna call it a problem. I think it's a drinking solution. Depends. Again, I'd say I'm the most professional when it is absolutely not not specifically necessary. Like, like I don't know. I'm I'm very very cautious and conscious of like of I don't know not. Well, I guess this is actually kind of remotely professional. I try not, I'm, I'm so cognizant of not offending local cultures and customs and things, so that's like a big thing for me. Like I, like whenever we go to an, another country or another state or anything, I'm always, I'm always like, oh, oh, we, we can't say that here, we can't do that here. You know, this is, there's a history here where this happened and whatever you can't, you, you know, this is offensive here, don't put the, you know, whatever, that kind of stuff. Um, which I guess falls into professionalism, but then I'm very late all the time and that kind of stuff. I'd say, Pete, probably. Uh, fuck, that would probably... I'll put that on myself. Joe. <laughs> Top three things you play about. Uh, being sick. Uh, not getting enough sleep. Uh, the rest of us annoying him. <laughs> Joe. Come on, don't make me say this. You can say yourself. But what did everyone else say? <laughs> Three members of the band have been mentioned. I think we all know who it is. Unequivocal. I'll, I'll say me. <laughs> Just to be nice. <laughs> it's Joe, come on. Joe complains a lot. <laughs> no secret. I, I'm not being mean. I love Joe, but he does complain a little bit. Mm, who was nominated for that one? You and Patrick. Oh, really? I'm a pretty big complainer. Patrick's a big complainer too, though. I think it just really switches off. I'll, I'll throw myself under for that one, sure. I know I complain a, a good deal. Try to be aware of that. Uh, Joe wants to sound check the most. I don't think anyone else particularly wants to. But Patrick's always like jumping on. Ben Affleck will do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he crawled all the way. Uh, let's say Joe. Andy's got a really good attitude at sound check. 
Or is that not true? Is that what, not what other people say? Oh, I think he's, he's good. I think I'm always, I'm usually up there first. <laughs> I don't know if that, what that means. What do people say about that one? <laughs> um, Andy got mentioned. And okay, I'll say Andy. Uh, Andy. Um, probably Andy Hurley. He just always kind of like shows up and he's like, I'm, I'm cool, I'm good. <laughs> Easy breezy, beautiful cover girl. 